As we saw in the introduction to custom fields video, sometimes you want to store something in case manager, but there's no place to put it. Custom fields enable you to create special places for your information. Let's look at an example. Susan wants to store a reasonable adjustment review date in her ComCare cases. So she needs to create a custom field. She thinks about two questions. The first one is what kinds of cases need this field? She decides that only ComCare cases need the reasonable adjustment review date. So her custom field will apply to cases where the category is ComCare. And as we saw in the video, the field needs to appear under a custom tab that's linked to this category. Remember, it's the tab, not the field, that has to be linked to the category. Hmm. She decides that the Return to Work tab looks suitable. So she creates the new custom field. It's a case custom field. The tab is Return to Work. Give it a name and make it a date field. So, back to the checklist. What kind of users should see or change it? She decides that all consultants should be able to see and change the field. So the consultant security group should see and change it. Click the security tab. Select the consultant security group. Click add and make sure that both view and modify are set to allow. Now, it will be really easy for consultants to add a reasonable adjustment review date to their ComCare cases. And they can display it in the case list, add it to document templates, and include it in custom forms.